I just gotta get you guys a shot of this big old mirage. This is the flight line. This is how heavy it is. These guys are waiting to take off. That's why you gotta fill your header tanks up. And we actually run off of that fuel until uh, we're ready to take off. Then we disconnect that fuel and then we're running on on board fuel. But we don't do that until the flight line director, that guy right there, gives us the okay. This is really well an orchestrated setup. These guys do an awesome job. See Marvin F-14 right there. Okay, when someone calls for a, a gear check pass, they hold up one hand. And then, uh, see how Marvin's doing that? What's going on, Marvin? Gear pass, gear pass. see? Someone's putting, getting ready to land. They're calling for a gear pass. See, now he's letting everybody know. Okay, it's now all these guys communicate. They don't land at the same time. Okay, so that guy there is calling for a gear pass. Marvin went behind him. He's holding up one hand. And he's going. And he's coming around. Coming in. Now someone else is calling for a gear pass. Oh, that was Mr. Bob Bottom himself. It's really well orchestrated. There we got the Fly Eagle boys. Got low. The Ollie get ready to take off the hog. And we got one of our fans. What's going on? Having fun today? Oh yeah. Hey, from RC USA Jets Direct. USA RC Jets. There we go. I was close. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Oh, that cool breeze feels good. But it gets kind of hectic out of here, out here. But these, but these guys do a really good job on the flight line. I think we got a full scale taking off. We're landing. So we got to clear the sky. We'll be back with more Kentucky Jets 2013, baby.